What up, peeps? We are back, taking a look at Madden NFL 21 Next Gen. Now, I've never really paid any detailed attention to what's going on in the environment, but with this leap to Next Gen, let's dive in and take a closer look. And yes, this is all inspired by the bar that was set by NBA 2K21 Next Gen with their improvements, crowds, players, just different anomalies overall that's been going on throughout the environment. Okay, now let's start off from a distance. The crowd is pretty live and everything looks pretty natural, but when you zoom in, that soon fades and you realize things are very unnatural and it shows in the celebrations. I mean, these dance moves are so in sequence, it's ridiculous. And this seems to happen throughout every stadium in every crowd. It appears to be a lot of copy and paste when it comes to these NPCs, and I'm sure even 2K and other franchises do the same thing, but it's very noticeable in Madden. Now the player models themselves I really don't have a problem with. I would just like to see more natural celebrations and not everyone attached to the same string when it comes to emotion and reaction. Okay, I do realize that all fans do not bring rain gear to the games, but come on, not one poncho, umbrella, anything in the whole crowd. Everyone just out there getting all soaked and wet down to the socks, my goodness. But when it comes to snow, they are all prepared. Hats, hoodies, heavy coats, exactly what you would see in an NFL crowd. Now here's another example. These fans have box seats. I mean, excellent seats. But they're just out here looking like zombies. No interactions with each other whatsoever. And I'm sitting here thinking maybe it's because there's no action at the moment. Well, Zeke scores a touchdown and look how they react. <sighs> now, with the next gen version, they did add some clips, not from the standard crowd, but these clips have completely new crowd models and animations and they look solid. If they made these models standard along with the animations, and this is actually what I was expecting with the next gen version, but we'll see what happens next year. Now the sideline and on-field action is kinda in the same boat, just very unnatural reactions. And not across the board, but definitely in spots. Here's a pass to Michael Thomas and this camera crew. I mean, what are they focusing on? Or are they just too focused on nothing? <laughs> to be honest. This is a pretty good clip that starts out natural. He's like, good catch, yeah. And then my man over here is just gonna sit here and stare at the ball. Another example, we have this guy here who's on the Pittsburgh sidelines. He's got his phone, he's chilling. But then I move the camera over here to the Texan sidelines. And does this face look familiar? <sighs> it's the same guy. And lastly, I would have made an exception if only one person's arms were this pale. I could let that slide, but come on now. Apparently these two guys wear long sleeves all summer long until it's game time, then they want to bust out the pale arms. Oh my. Alright peeps, that's it. Just taking a look at this leap to next gen with Madden NFL 21 to see if there were any improvements. Unfortunately, we just got an upgrade of current gen. I think everyone kind of predicted this. I mean, they did add a twist with the clips, but hopefully they can improve on that in the future and we could see um, just more natural reaction, emotion, different anomalies going on on the sidelines in the crowd. All right, peeps, that's it. Let us know what type of improvements you would like to see in the Madden NFL franchise with this leap to next gen. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Alright peeps, you know what it is. Until next time. Gee.